Hello and welcome back to Pyre. I am Lazy Bones and I kind of started playing already. I thought I hit the record button, but I didn't. My bad. Uh, we already picked the location that we're supposed to go next. I don't remember what it's called. Jadario. Oh wait, I'm Lazy Bones. Wait, did we do this already? I did the introductions, right? Oh my gosh, I have terrible memory. <laughs> okay, then. It is as I feared. We are to pass further north, beneath the valley into the flinging hands. Hm. A gloom-filled, desolate region of the downside, beyond which lies the sea. The sea? Oh, not her again, God. <laughs> the scribes <laughs> are watching over us. I was going to do a super lady voice, but no. They will protect us wherever we should, should go. <laughs> Had you been to flanging hands, you would not say such things. The scribes have surely turned their backs on that place. You read that? You read that? If I may, the blackness of flanging hands shall wear upon you to be sure. I urge for you to take what rest you can, for you shall need your strength upon the road ahead. Your fellow exiles agree to turn in for the remainder of the night. At dawn, you shall have to press deeper into the downside. Okay. This. Talk to the dog. Doggy. What is this? Up in the rafters. Okay. Let's interact with Rookie. Uh, you can tell something is troubling Rookie, though he seems relieved to see you. Hey, um, chum, listen, I got a le to level with you for really quick. You remember Barker, don't you? Not exactly easy to forget, though I believe you me. What? Though believe you me. I try. Tommy. Oh. Well, he's got me by the scruff. I've been down here a little while, as you can see by now. But Barker, he's been here longer. He's made quite the name down here. As for me, I needed help. You understand? I had a certain standard to uphold. So... I figured he would be the one to ask. Then, Rookie hesitates. But then, oh, but then, his familiar grin returns. He's not a flatty. So, what if I owe him? Though, right, chum? I got people back on the other side. And just between us, we're loaded. I mean, rich. My little, my little problem with Barker, soon, it's gonna take care of itself. Just as soon as my people send the money, though. Th hmm. So, I am telling you right here and now, don't you even worry about it. I am sure everything on that front is going to end up real tidy, real soon. With that, he scramps off before you can respond. It seems Rookie owes a debt of some sort. What is on the line exactly, you are unsure. Okay. Well, let's continue the journey. The heck was that? Oh. Uh, come down, you find Hedwin and Jadariel assessing the current situation with the minstrel. Are you most certain? Aye, aye, madame. I make no claim your journey shall be pleasant, but it is necessary. Hedwin motions to you as they continue talking. Seems we'll have some work to do once we arrive in Flagging hands. Let's get going. Soon as you're ready. Sooner we get there, 
sooner we can leave. Flagging hand. No other options except for that. There's dreadlocks, I just noticed. Flogging hands. Mm, the ocean looks pretty bad. Nope, nobody. Do I read this? Nope. Alright, consider how to proceed. The flanging hands regain pro region proves as dismal as Jadariel indicated. The air is thick and foul. How far to the pit of Milith? Uh, oh, I should oh, read that. All the way across the marshlands on the coast. Reader, would you join me in the wagon for a moment? We have matters to discuss. Jadario and Hedwin exchange looks, then she turns to you. Go see what he wants. Flum Minstrel. Thank you for your time, Rita. I have something for you on behalf of my client. Before is before you is an artifact called the Beyonder Crystal. An ancient artifact connected to the rites. Should the reader manage in your eyes, present the crystal only then. What the should the reader manage in your eyes present the crystal only then okay you observe a shimmering crystal of some some sort beside the book of rights as you have surmised the triumvirates you are to confront during the rites shall stop at nothing to prevail against you they have prepared for this for quite some time the Beyonder Crystal may help ensure that you are well prepared in turn. It is, a re it is a resource now at your disposal, to be used at your discretion. Gaze upon it, and you shall see what I mean. Henceforth, you may use the Beyonder Crystal. It is calling you. Take a closer look. The Beyonder Crystal seeks Rookie. It does. You look upon the shimmering surface of the Beyonder Crystal. Some of your senses fail, like the band, through though you retain a hold over your consciousness. An apparition appears before you, clad in the remnants of the rites, but incorporeal. Corporeal. Oh boy, I cannot... I sense that you are not a total idiot. She reaches for the clasps, clasps on her mask. <gasps> Phantom. So, the Nightwings have returned. Oh, but where are my manners? You must be their lovely reader. Please, call me Sandra. She, Sandra the Ever Seeing, she is a wraith expelled for eternity within the Beyonder Crystal and bound to serve the rites. We met briefly before, when you first beheld the book, when you were stuck inside of it. I was among the phantoms you or companions banished there, no doubt stroking their egos. You listened well enough to that damned voice. Now, I suggest you listen well to me, voice. Describing within the book, it calls to you during the rites and reminds you of your exile. I am bound to servitude, in servitude to you. 
along with any idiots whose freedoms have happened to be intertwined with yours. I know the rights better than anyone. I soon can, sh I soon can whip you into shape if you but take advantage of my services. First, I offer scribe, tour, scribe trails to those friends of yours. If they can pass, I shall be, it shall be worth their while and yours. Why do I, am I screwing this up so much today? Secondly, my beyonders. And I avail ourselves for practice rites. Should you be so inclined. Beyonders? The Beyonders, a special triumvirate banished for eternity and trapped within the rites. Practice rites, no strings, at no strings training competitions between your fellow exiles and Sanders Beyonders. Or you could always come and chat and briefly free me from eternity of boredom. Hmm. You have invoked Sandra from the Beyonder Crystal. What do you wish to do? Request of her a scribe trail trial. Challenge her to a practice right. Ask what is on her mind. Bid her farewell. Well, what's on your mind? I do appreciate the efforts to make small talk with me, reader. Anything to break from the mo monon monotony of starting. Uh, of staring at the void within this place. Not that I could see it if I tried. <laughs> she laughs at this, or maybe at herself. Curren currently, I could make talk with my fellow Beyonders, trapped here as they are with me. You might expect that we all would keep each other company. There's just one problem. There, however. <laughs> We are all sick of one another. <laughs> she laughs again, perhaps not at her joke, but instead at her predicament. I do exaggerate to some extent, but there is a certain truth in this. We have been stuck together long enough that we have grown more distant rather than more close. But I had best not wear out my welcome with the likes of you as I have long since done with all the others. So, carry on for now. And if those fools with whom you travel learn something, come bring them forth to me, and I shall t see to it they learn some more. Hmm. Hmm, but you're s let's do this. Why not? You express your... You express your interest in the practice rites. It seems to be a way to practice conducting the rites without all the pressures of the real thing. <laughs> Certainly, reader. That is why I'm here. You see in that blasted book in just a moment, my beyonders shall be waiting. Okay, so we're gonna have a practice battle, huh? Cool, 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 kill. Oh, I just noticed we're in the book. Oh, this place. So, we're back. Look there, our host approaches. Sandra appears and looks upon your fellow exiles. Welcome to the practice rites. My green. Thanks. Great to be back. Love the door. Honest. Silence, Kerr. You are fortunate your reader summoned you again. You could use a little discipline. Now, come forth and let us see how capable you are. In the practice rites, no enlightenment is awarded. You must train here with your fellow exiles as much as you wish, or press this button to return to the wagon at any time. What does this do exactly? After banishing an adversary, the bearer gains plus one gold. Oh! 
Let's not use that. Hmm. It's not that fast. No talent is... Uh, no talisman is good. It's really fine with me. Choose this guy. Take this off. And give it to her. Speed. That's what I need. If you are ready, then Nightwings. Grasp the orb, and we shall train with you. I was like waiting for them to move. What the? Hey, hey, hey. What the heck? Oh, I can't move past that. Whew. Okay, so there. Thanks. Oh. Well, I'm still getting used to the controls. Jump, 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 fling, sprint. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. No. This guy's definitely the best one to uh, use. The other girl's sprint is more like a dash. He wasn't really aiming at me, it's strange. No, there you go. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wow, he took us out at the same time. Ah. Does that? <laughs> F word. That should have been a shutout. No, I don't like her. This is sprinting. That's how you sprint. They just do like a dash. It's annoying. Definitely found my favorite character. Oh. Nice catch.
Night rings! We did it! Okay. <laughs> so that's how the practice thing goes, huh? Is that it? Okay. Your vision returns as the effects of the Beyonder Crystal dissipate. Time seems to have stood still while you experienced the vision. Alright. Cool, that's cool. Continue the journey. You know what? I'm gonna end the episode here. Yeah. So, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. I'm Lazy Bones. This is Pyre. Take care of yourselves. And I'll see you on the next episode. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.